Good morning, kids. Hello, and how are you doing? Welcome to Saturday Morning Cartoons, the show where we barely show any cartoons at all, but just have fun opening non-sport packs. So why don't we get right into this? The first pack we're going to open today is Brain Straining Doodle Wonkers. Gotta love the name. Still don't understand the set or the cards. But let's see what we can get out of this pack right here. Wow. We actually got a brain straining doodle wonkers baseball. Circle the number that tells how many players are shown. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Facts your friends don't know. Not going to read it because it's really tiny. And so is the stuff on Brain Drain. Now these are interesting. We got five stickers here that obviously make up something without a body. And we also got a card that can be punched out and stood up. Some people I've gifted packs to and opened them and said, oh yeah, the stickers go on this. Well, not if you look at how it's designed. I'm not sure exactly how those are going to go on this and make something out of it. But who knows? Maybe, maybe not. Next, hey, Decision 92. That was kind of a corny and cartoony time to vote. And... Look at that, the biggest cartoon of them all. Ross Perot and his ears have their own subset. That's right, he has a subset because his ears won't fit in the regular base set. Hope you guys do go out there and have a good, good Saturday today. Have a fun weekend and have a real nice Martin Luther King Day on Monday. I know I'm off. And why not? President Bush on health issues. Next up, these are sticking just a little bit, but this one's cool. I like this one for my PC. We have a flashback. What is a flashback of? Tricky Deck with Watergate. Next up, we have Pro Choice. I'm agreeing with that card right there. And then we have the Democratic National Convention, which is pretty cool. Wow. The vice presidential choice. Wow, that's a nice card. Is that who I think it is? I will let you all be the judge. We have Wealthy in America. Ha! <laughs> and, of course, we have one of our justices here. What was his name here? Um, Thomas. Thomas Thomas with Anita Hill. Da, 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 da. Doesn't say his first name, just keeps saying Thomas. Well, I'm sure you'll recognize him. It's on sexual harassment. Ooh, really like this one. Look at JFK. John Fitzgerald Kennedy. This is a nice card. We have the Middle East. Which is weird. In this country, we have an East Coast, a West Coast, and Midwest. You have to go halfway around the damn world to get to the Middle East. A nice flashback of a JFK prologue. That's really pretty cool. And the backs do tell all about them as well. Nice, nice set. I remember collecting the one that came out, which is now 30 years ago. Amazing. X-Files Season 2. See if we can pull out any sort of an insert or anything from one of these. Let's see, they are. 
there's our X Files group. And why wouldn't you get yourself a checklist? Ooh. He is called the host. You ready for this? I am. That's creepy. Creepy is all get out. And next up we have Irresistible. Not quite sure what's irresistible about that. I'm resisting opening another pack. We have Our Town. Followed by Walter S. Skinner. Very cool. Very nice. How about the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? The new season. Eight cards per pack. Look for foil cards. Not going to hold my breath because I may not make it past this video. Alrighty. Well, first up, we have the Pink Ranger. Looking all sorts of pretty. Next up, we have Angry Ruler. That's right. It's called Angry Ruler. What in the world is this guy? I never watched Power Rangers. I never knew anything about it. But I guess his name is Clay Brain. Clay Brain. <laughs> and go along with Clay Brain, we have a putty problem. Come on, focus. Don't focus, that's fine. But yes. Putty problem. And we have back in the dumpster. Not a place I'd like to ever be. What in the world is... Oh! Huh. Interesting. Congador? That's cheesy. Look at this. We got an acetate of the Pink Ranger. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ask and ye shall receive. We have Aisha, the new yellow ranger, in a foil. Look at that. That's an awesome pack with two inserts. I'll take that all day long. How about we finish up now with Rob Van Dam in Street Fighter. Never saw the movie. Don't really care about Rob Van Dam. Never played the video game. So let's go into this half blind, which I am anyway. It's just Street Fighter. I mean, the backs tell a lot about the card, but there's not really much for a title on the card. Look, they're in a boat. And this one, at least on the back, says Superstar Saget. Not Bob Saget, the one you don't want to meet in a dark alley. <laughs> and yes, in true upper deck form, Saget Saget, back to back, back. And the next card after that was Superstar M. Bison. What do we have coming up here? We have another one without really a name on it. But there's Van Damme, I believe. We have Street Fighters Sawada Japan. And another checklist. Well, we did great on checklists today. That's quite a few. So, everybody, I am so glad you tuned in and watched and tried to enjoy. That's all I can ask. Again, have a great, great rest of your Saturday. Tune in tomorrow for Sunday shout-outs. And we'll do it all again next week. So be the best you that you can be. Keep your stick on the ice. We're all in this together. And remember, peace.
Peace.